Hey guys, and welcome to He Beat Her. Uh, this game is about um, him beating her. I think um, it, it's 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 a game about finding out whether this person actually was abusive or not or something. But look at those eyes. Look at those dreamy little eyes. Oh yeah, he couldn't have beat anyone. Those eyes were are way too pretty. Let's go right in. Oh, I like the uh, I like the scratching the backward thing. Courtroom 3 p.m. The court appointed you for another domestic abuse case. It's hopeless. Your client, accused of abusing, is going to be found guilty. It's a five-minute afternoon break. Uh, your client sits next to you. His ex sits across the aisle. Right after his, br right after this break is the verdict. You're running out of time to defend him. There's only one time. There's only time for one more action. Okay, press enter when decided. Uh, he is guilty. <laughs> no, 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 no. We, I yield. I don't think so. Leave. You leave the courtroom. <laughs> Quite impolite, but cost you a bar license. But you can't be fucked to help this guy who also is frankly fucked. The break's up. Your client is found guilty and given a jail sentence of a year. He's laid out of the courtroom, you wonder. It's over. Alright, okay, okay, that's a cool. This is a cool different kind of game. Okay, uh. What could we do? Punch! Uh, okay, sure, good, okay. You can't punch people for no reason. What about, um, flirt? With the judge, I can't type. Oh, there you go. Flirt! Oh, is there a question mark here? Think, talk, observe, grab. Oh. Okay, what if I think? What if I use my thonking brain? I've gotten something important. Have you? Um. Hmm. Grab? I need to hurry. What to grab? Water. Water's always good. What are you talking about? Um, wine. Ah, that's right. Wine's not that great. I mean, I wouldn't know, but still. Uh, gu um, gun. Wait, that didn't, that, that wasn't an option. Okay, wow. Um, files. But why? Him. What can I do? Um, I don't want the pats. Um, all right, I'm gonna go all the way back. Uh, what should I do? Can I kiss? You give your client a surprise kiss, although you promise him he's in a rebound. I feel like you're forgetting someone. Oh, the break's up. Your client doesn't stand a chance. Okay, well, he's gone. Uh, um, can I die? Try to melt in your seat and die, but it's not possible. No worries, it'll happen eventually. <laughs> okay. Okay. Uh, can I innocent? Uh, however, he let out of the courtroom, you wonder. Can I try again? Huh, okay, so I'm gonna look it up because, you know, there's- I, I don't know what to do. Um, ask. Abuse. Were you abused or did you abuse? That's quite blunt. It's okay if you don't want to answer. I wasn't abused. That's so shameful. Don't ask me that again. Please. Alright, okay. The break's up. Oh. Hmm. So he wasn't abused. If I observe... Cli client. He wears heavy ice bags and a turtleneck sweater. He may have once been an energetic man, but you can't tell now. A turtleneck in a hot courtroom. Oh. A turtleneck. 
He might be hiding something. He might be hurt or something. All right, what if we ask him for the turtleneck? All right. Turtleneck. It's hot as hell. Why are you wearing that turtleneck? Because I'm cold. I need the truth if you want to stand a chance. Look, I have some scars on my arms. It's no big deal. I fell from the stairs is all. What's that scar on your neck? Oh, he has scars on his neck. Okay. This? Haha. <laughs> Fine, you want the truth? She came at me one day with a knife and had to block her and then she headbutted me? Okay, this is going places. Who's gonna believe that? You still love her, huh? I mean, not really the best thing to do, but you do you, man. Sorry is valuable, but it's only spoken words. It might not hold up against court. Okay, okay. Ask... Medicatione. Are you taking medication? Yeah, for pain. But I lost all my records a while ago. They were, uh... Where'd your records go? They're with my girlfriend. I wonder why she took them. Because she can take the pills! Can't function well without my meds. Okay. F phone. What are your opinions on phones? Phones? I lost mine recently, actually. But my girlfriend, or my ex now, I guess. She'd always be on hers. But it's, it, it's easy to distract her from it. Let's talk about sad things. Alright, this is interesting. So what if we, um... Grab the phone from her? Grab... Uh... Phone. Hey, nice phone you got there. Well, some evil people have evil phones. Those evil phones are not nice. Mind if I take a look? Um, what kind of question is that? No, sorry. Huh. Asking her isn't going to work, but if you really wanted to, you could distract her with something. Oh, um... Wasn't it just sad? She's had sad thoughts though. Okay, uh, what, I, I guess I needed to find more about him. So what if I ask... Uh, um, sad? Sad. What's the saddest thing you and your ex thought about? Great conversation starter. Oh yeah, best conversation starters ever. Well, the saddest thing was probably our dog, Krissa. Okay, we're getting names. She died a few months ago. Max has been weird since too. The break's up. Okay, 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 all right. We're getting somewhere. What if I try to ask about Krissa? Ask... Krissa. Okay, that's not appropriate. Um, uh, what about... Bipolar? What do you know about bipolar? Nothing much. Your ex might have bipolar. I found her pr I did? Um... I don't think I... Uh, I don't think I was supposed to do that. <laughs> She's been acting strange and I just can't after the incident. The incident? Huh, the breaks up. Unit client lost a case. Okay, so... I think it's to do with the dog. The dog might have died first. All right, I'm gonna quickly go get the purse. Steal. Purse. Can I see your purse? She looks at you in disbelief. Ha ha ha. What? I don't even know you! She won't budge. What should you do? Hmm... I'm going to, um... Convince her. Okay, what should she talk about? Uh... Krissa? About her dearest friend. I really love her and, well, she loves me back. Feels good, man. Haha. <laughs> Feels bad, man. We're open to you. She lets you look into her purse. She's a unique brand of trusting, that's for sure. Yeah, you're very unique. Suspicious looking medication records. They have your client's signature and as as well as his say, social security number, which you do not memorize. You rummage further into the purse and find a ripped up prescription for bipolar medication. The breaks up. Okay, we're getting somewhere now. We are getting somewhere. Think. Plaintiff. The plaintiff is browsing her phone, texting someone, maybe. Is that allowed in a courtroom? She looks very friendly. You remember the girl who was friendly? Something red. Until she wasn't anymore. Alright, so what if I talk to the 
person again. Grab phone. Um, Chris, I think it was. Wait, can I put anything with? Oh wait, I already. I, 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 oh, what do you search for? Um, let me search up the knife. Find strings of text to Gianna. That sounds familiar. Texts are incriminating. I'm really scared, to be honest. What do you think happened? The bee. It's not your fault. Don't tell anyone. Okay. Telling Gianna that she didn't remember anything, but woke up to bloody handprints and bruised boyfriend. Please need find evidence. A restraining order is filed. Not against your client, but against his ex-girlfriend. You promise to keep in touch with your client. Oh. I'm gonna try once more. And, um, I want to see if I can put it bipolar as a thing. So grab phone and then Krissa uh, bipolar. She has bipolar. Where you text your friends? I can't afford the medicine. It's okay, babe. You don't need it. You're the sweetest girl I know. Notes to herself. Dear diary, my boyfriend said this diary thing would be good for me, so here goes. Today was really bad. The doctor said I'm I'm crazy. Well, bipolar. Same thing. I read my bipolar prescription. There's no way I have bipolar. I'm not crazy. I can't be. Hmm. My girlfriend got into an argument, so I'm stressed after the diagnosis, and maybe I said something bad, but he threw a plate, and I don't remember. So sorry, look, here's what we're gonna do. You also have evidence for your client. What will you do? Hmm. I'm not gonna go against him. Or what? Actually, no, I'll, I, I don't know. Okay. Alright, wait. Um, I can do one last thing. I'm not sure if it'll work, but remember... Gianna. Has beautiful red hair, smart and strange. Can't remember anything else. You still have her number, but there's no reason to call it. Is there? Okay, so I'm gonna try rem uh, calling her this time. So remember, Gianna. I can't put yes. What do I do? Wait, can I ask him about Gianna? Ask. Um, might have glitched the game out. I think I glitched the game out. Oh no. I glitched the game out. Ah, oh, crap. I glitched it. Okay, anyways, um, that's all the time I have for today. Today. Thank you guys for watching. Um, I did. I did technically. I did technically get both endings. So you know. Eh. But yeah, it's a pretty interesting game where you put in your own put in your own words and try to find out everything else. Um, yeah, it was really fun, and it was really interesting. Art again was amazing, um, and, and the music as well. Anyways, thank you guys for watching. I will see you in the next video. Goodbye.